soon I'm gonna get my cooking channel but before then let's discuss how we deal with handling heavy pots with boiling water if you can cool it off first if you cannot if you have to boil the water and drain it immediately first thing first make sure you have plenty of room in the sink so you don't have to contort yourself to drain it behind cups or whatnot second use some gloves so when you're draining the heavy pot of boiling water you don't need to deal with the temperature that you're safe lifting you want to be close to the pot but of course it's hot so you cannot be too close you need to have a certain distance that's safe but still not far that it's oh my god this is my arms are shaky now but if I get my skeleton underneath somewhat underneath without compromising safety oh this is much more possible use the side of the surface so when you're draining you don't have to deal with the whole weight I would tip it gently like this to drain my friend told me and she is petite that she puts the whole pot inside and then uses ladle to empty at least half before it gets lighter when she can deal with the whole weight now if you're dealing with a serious injury with your lower back you may benefit from from a better stance so let's say you have that heavy pot here and you do need to lean forward a little bit open the door of the cabinet underneath the sink so you can place your foot basically to see the, on the camera that you will do something like this you standing by straddling when you lean forward you can st stop the falling forward motion with your foot if I don't have my foot I lean forward and I have to catch myself on my toes my calves they won't be as strong as having this kind of stance so here I can lean forward safely oh remember about the half cup we need to save it if you're making mashed potatoes make sure you leave half a cup of water of that boiling water for mashing that works beautiful you don't even need butter afterwards they're just mm, delicious for delicious mashed potatoes or without it tilting again using the surface that's our tip I hope it was useful